Let's add an NFS shared directory backup with Lone Tar. Let's go to Device Manager from the Lone Tar main menu. We're going to add a new device, A to add. Select option number 9 for a mounted device. This can be a NAS, RDX, RD1000, or a USB device. The alias can be what you want. I'm going to call it an NFS share. This will be the directory where the NFS is mounted on the local server, minus slash backup. Block factor, I'm going to use 120. I always recommend 120 or 64. The capacity can be whatever capacity you want on Linux. I always use no compression for the fastest backup speeds. Here you're going to want to enter in the mount command. And from our example, we have already having a command for NFS backups with Linux. You can unmount the backup after a successful backup and verify the default is yes. And your rotation, we have six options. I recommend a minimum weekly, which is what I'm selecting, but you can do whatever you desire. And if you want to use this device for crash recovery, please answer yes to this question. And that's how you set up an NFS backup. And the last thing you would want to do is we're going to want to test it so we can go back to the main menu, go to the selective backup menu. And I like to back up just the user Lone Tar directory. And if that goes through with a backup and verify, your device is good and properly set up.